Betty Fernandez and I'm an art teacher. Visit my website at pattyfernandezartist.com. Okay, let's draw. Today's project is how to draw Shakmul, an ancient Mexican god. So I take two fingers from the top and right in the center I put a dot. And from that dot I'm going to draw a slightly curved line to the left, go back to the dot, slightly curved line to the right. I go back to the left and I draw a straight line up, slightly curved line over, straight line down, connect. I come back to the left. I draw a straight line, curve line, straight line, connect. On the left hand side I draw a straight line out, straight line down, straight line in, connect. And on the right side I draw a straight line out, straight line down, straight line in, connect. I come right over here on the left and I'm going to draw a straight line down, curve line over, straight line up, connect. And on the left hand side I'm going to draw a slightly curved line out, diagonal line down, off the page. I come on this side on the right and I draw a curve line down, curve line out, slightly curve line up, off the page. I come back on the inside on the right hand side and I'm going to draw a connecting line down and inside I'm going to go one, two, three straight lines, one, two, three straight lines. Now this section right here is his arm. I'm going to come back on the right and I'm just going to draw a straight diagonal up, a little curved line off the page. I'm going to continue this line, jump over and draw a little curved line down. I come back up to the top. I start on the left and on the inside I go straight line, down, over, up, in, down, over, up, and stop. On the right hand side, straight line down, over, up, straight line down, over, and up. I come on the inside and I'm going to draw curve line up, curve line down, connect. On the left, curve line up, curve line down, connect on the right. I come right in the center and I just go straight line, curve line, straight line up, and down right about here I'm just going to draw a slightly curved line, curved line, and over. I come all the way up at the top and I just add some little straight lines on the top line and I come down and add some little straight lines on the bottom line. Let's see what we're going to do now for coloring him. Okay, Shakmul is a sculpture down in Mexico and he is made out of stone. So I'm going to take my dark brown crayon and any place I have a line, I'm going to trace that again over with my dark brown. And I'm just going to have that add a little bit of depth to what I've already drawn. So every line that I drew in black, now I come back in and I mimic those lines again all the way up, down, the whole entire section. Once I've done all of my outlining of all of these lines, I'm going to come in, oops I forgot his bracelets. Get up my black again, watch, sorry, straight line, straight line, straight line. Now yeah, that looks more like an arm now. Okay, again, I'm going to trace all of these lines. Don't forget your little line down here at the bottom. And make sure they're nice and dark. And basically this is all you need is a dark brown crayon. 
And now, I'm going to come over, and if you have peach or a lighter brown, you just do the whole entire picture with that brown, that lighter brown or peach color. Because he is made out of stone. Okay, let's see what he looks like all colored in. This is Shock Moodle all colored in. As you can tell, he's made out of stone and he is a sculpture. If you Google Shakmul, you can see the rest of his body. He has a very interesting way of sitting. But this will help you out if you're doing ancient civilizations. Okay, bye-bye.